Well, the 23rd anniversary of 9-11 is just a few days away, and the weight of that incident can be felt across the nation. News Channel 11's Maddie Cottespotti reports on one community that's honoring those who lost their lives on that tragic day. On the morning of September 11, 2001, two planes struck the Twin Towers. This morning, hundreds of participants climbed the stairs of Bristol Motor Speedway in honor of the many lives lost on 9-11. It gives people the opportunity to think back of where they were on 9-11, knowing that the whole country was affected. For 10 years, the Tri-Cities has remembered the events of 9-11 through the memorial stair climb. Taking place at Bristol Motor Speedway, participants made their way up and down the stairs. They will climb the height of the World Trade Center, which is 110 floors, in memory of those who were lost on 9-11. Over 700 people made the climb, many representing local fire departments and first responders. Some climbers wore fire gear, others donning hoses or weighted vests to try and understand what the first responders went through that day. Just to put ourselves in the, the weight of the responders that have to do the work and the support. It's very humbling just to be able to be here today, just to take a few steps in remembrance of those who have fallen before us. Following the climb, each climber rung a bell and read off the name of a responder who served during 9-11. Jean Dannon Felsick. For the climbers, it's important to remember the sacrifice each first responder made that day and the sacrifices that continue to be made. It's an impact on the community and the, and the nation as a whole. Um, so being able to remember those that have been lost and to serve our country is, is absolute honor. For our future, all the kids and coming up, for them to remember all the, the firefighters. In Bristol, Tennessee, Maddie Cottesbody, News Channel 11. Also, this year's stair climb, local fallen firefighters were honored, including Abingdon's Cameron Craig. Craig was killed in October of 2023 on the line of duty. His captain, Tim Estes, was involved in having special badges made in his honor. This year, they're, they're honoring three first responders that are local to the Tri-Cities. Uh, Fred McGrew, Firefighter Ward, and Cameron Craig from Abingdon. All those folks gave their life in service to our community. And today by them, including them, just allows all of us that participated just to remember them one more time.